Family and friends gathered to honor the life of a woman who was strangled inside her home on Tuesday. Police now say her neighbor has been charged with murder. Friday night on Walter Perez, the big story in Action News is the investigation into that gruesome murder in the Tioga Nice Town section of Philadelphia. Action News reporter Katie Catro joins us live from police headquarters with a reaction from the victim's loved ones. Katie. Walter, loved ones we spoke with today said there is no justice in this situation because nothing will bring their friend back. Tonight, they are grieving. You took it from me for no reason. Today, friends and family gathered to mourn the death of 43-year-old Takesha Boxill. Emotions running high outside of her home on the 1400 block of West Venango Street. She did not deserve this. Everybody out here know how good of a person she was. She helped everybody standing out here. She would have gave you the shirt off of her back. This is where police say they found Box Hill dead after conducting a welfare check on Tuesday after co-workers reported she didn't show up. Preliminary reports show she was strangled. These sisters' crimes got to stop. Police arrested Box Hill's neighbor, 55-year-old Alan Legree, who lives in an apartment in the same residence. Legree is charged with murder, tampering with evidence, and obstruction of justice. Loved ones say it's not enough because Box Hill is dead. There's nothing they can do. To, they can't do anything about this. She should be here with us right now. She should be here. It's unacceptable. Before her balloon release, memories of her were shared. But we're here to remember our friend, our sister, our buddy, our homie, our co-worker. She was a lovely person. She would call me some days and say, hey, you all right? Have a good day. Now, in Pennsylvania, protection orders can only be issued against intimate partners or family members. Loved ones we spoke with today do claim that Box Hill had repeated concerns about Legree. Reporting live here at police headquarters, Katie Catro, Fraction News at 10 on PHL 17. Walter. Real tragedy. All right, thank you, Katie.